There always tends to be leftovers during the holidays, and I found out some of the best tips on how to preserve your extra holiday favorites. After all of those holiday parties, most of the time you have plenty of food left over. And Kathy Friel is here from the MSU Extension to explain the best ways to preserve those leftovers. So Kathy, what are some of your top tips? Okay, mainly um, the biggest thing I can say is if you are in doubt, throw it out. If you're worried that your holiday food has spoiled, make sure you throw it away because you don't want to take chances with foodborne illnesses or having any of your guests or yourself become sick. Um, another one would be watch out for the danger temperatures. Anywhere between 40 degrees and 140 degrees, bacteria grows rampantly. So make sure that as soon as your leftovers and you're done serving, that you get them in the refrigerator in shallow dishes, airtight, sealed. Get them in the refrigerator where they're cooled and um, they're being kept safe then. And when it comes to food, there are certain types that can last a few days and others that are not so safe to eat after sitting out. You know, if you leave something out for two hours or longer, throw it away. If you have a holiday meal or something and your food is left out, get rid of it. If you are having a big buffet or something and you know that you're going to leave food out over the day for a, few, a period of hours, have extra food in the refrigerator so that you can pull some out and get rid of the old stuff. We don't want to have our guests be sick, like I said before. So, um, and general rule is if you have like vegetables, you can keep those three to four days once they're cooled in the refrigerator. Um, meats, a little bit longer, four to five days. So, as always though, if you are in doubt, I can't say this enough, if you're in doubt, throw it out, get rid of it because you don't want to become sick. We want to enjoy the holidays and enjoy our time together. Well, thank you so much, Kathy, and hopefully those tips can help you save most of your holiday food and not have to throw it in the trash.